Ha! Huh. There's a lot of emotions in that scene. A lot of emotions. Hup, 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 hup. Hey, time to change shifts. How's the girl acting? Ha! <laughs> Koala's a mouse. She might be a bracer, but she's just a kid. Probably curled up in a bed, scared out of her mind. Ha! <laughs> Babysitting while everyone else is out here sucks. This is so boring. I want to get out there into the auction. Quit your warning! These are Leonhard's orders, and hell if I'm not gonna follow them. Here's instructions to the letter. Eh? What's that sound? Oi! Hey, what are you doing? You don't think. She escaped! Damn it. That stupid girl. Does she not get where she is? She's trying to kill herself or something? Dot dot dot. Oh, gonna take me right now. She probably fell. You've gotta be kidding me. What are we gonna tell Leonard that he that'll let us keep our heads? A damn brat. Nothing but a load of trouble. Damn brat, huh? Oh shit! Oh, you! Nice trial, man. <laughs> Never underestimate a bracer. First of all, don't you think that was a little rude? Calling a sweet maiden like myself a damn brat. It wasn't me. I don't call you. I swear. Oh, you didn't? Well, you didn't correct your buddy either. Either way, it's nap time for you. No. Okay. Reinforcements probably gonna get here real quick, so I should book it. There's gotta be somewhere off this boat. And I won't give up. Not until I see Joshua. Not until I see that dummy again. You won't stop for anything, Lo. Well, neither will I! And time to go! Can I loot their bodies? What is this, D&D? Fucking book ass! Not that way. That's the way the guards came. We can't go that way. Can't use the elevator, it's voice activated. We gotta find another way out of here. Dun 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 Up, wait. Yeah, okay, so there are robots. We gotta be carefully careful about battles. I'm the only one here. Nice. Good, keep going. Real sneaky and safe. Real sneaky and safe. Watch out for robots. Okay, actually, because of my panic, I'm just gonna real quick. There we go, alright. You gotta keep moving. Elevators are voice activated. That's the way they came. Okay. We gotta we gotta figure out a way out of here. Oh nice. Okay. So far so good. Stick to the plan. Just keep it keep it together. Keep it together. Frip. Okay. <sighs> Shit. What is this? Can't get past there. Got it. Okay. Doodly -doo 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 -doo. Across the hallway. Okay. Yep. Okay. <sighs> we gotta fight it. Alright. What's it weak to? Uh, a patrol weapon developed by the society can repair allies. Alright, this isn't that bad. Take it out. Good job, Estelle. Nice. Okay, let's keep moving. Okay, cross the bridge. So far, so good. Okay, we're past this thing now. There's an oh god, there's a bunch of them. This is probably gonna be a bit tougher. I think we're just gonna go for it. Multiple enemies as a single person is not a fun fight for me. Okay. Back across the way if we can. Perfect. Good, good, good. Okay. We're making progress, guys. We're definitely making progress. We just need to stay lighter on our toes. Don't get fooled by anything. I just want to make sure. Okay, up here. What's this? Aha! Misty Veil. I think I'm already wearing that, but I want to double check. Yeah, I'm already wearing it. Cool. All right. Then I'll give that to somebody else when we've reformed the party. I have to make my escape. Like, like I've got to get out of here. There's no, there's no other way around it. I need to get out of here. 
But I have no idea how I'm gonna do it. Whoa! Okay. Right. Darn it, wrong way. This looks like the main deck. Someone please tell me why this thing has to be so ridiculously huge and easy to get lost in. At this point, my only real hopes are either find a parachute or somewhere how to take control of one of the smaller airships. Either way, I gotta keep going. Okay. Can't see over here because it won't let me change the camera. Nope. Okay. There's gotta be another something. Perfect. There she is. Ah, oh, crap. Crap. Double crap. Nah, it's far enough, girly. Not too bad, though, escaping from custody on the Glorious and all. Dotto Cassius's bride does not disappoint. You understand, of course, that trying to resist is pointless. Be a good little girl and lay down your weapon. What a pathetic young showing, Estelle Bright. Huh? Oh, don't you recognize me with a helmet, do you? Fine, then. Look into the face of the one who you bested. Huh? Huh, you remember at last. I no doubt you even thought to encounter me again even in your worst nightmares, hmm? This young man is... Uh, I think I remember seeing your face before. Who are you again? Huh? I'm Gilbert, the former steward of the Honorable Mayor Dalma. You could at least remember the people you arrested. Well, excuse the heck out of me for being surprised. I mean, first of all, we didn't even hand... Didn't we hand you over to the army for trial and stuff? How'd you even manage to get here? Heh. <laughs> you no doubt my resourcefulness. During the coup, I managed to escape in the chaos. Shortly after, Ouroboros found me, and so I pledged my allegiance to them. I don't know whether to call that tenacious or just thick-headed. Are you seriously a Jaeger? You're not actually gonna fight, are you? And again, you underestimate me. I am a prodigy of the sword as much as the pen, a master of both. But uh, I remember how you screamed back when we got, when you got roughed up by those special op guys at the lighthouse. You really think you're cut out for combat? It's all high pitched too, like. Silence! I've been part of a huge number of combat enhancement programs since I entered the society's service. My physical abilities have greatly increased and my knowledge of battle tactics is unparalleled. Don't think you can best me again, bracer scum. For the love of, oh, I'll just play along for now. Now then, Estelle Bright, if you want to live, throw aside your stick and get down to your knees and beg for mercy. If you do that, I may even forgive your past transgressions. Oh, what an offer. I moved to tears here, really. But it's alright, I'm pretty thick-headed too. Eep! Maybe I can't beat one of your, maybe I can't even beat one of your crazy enforcers on my own. But I sure can throw down with the likes of you. So bring it on, Screamer! So I have five people against me here. That's, that bodes ill. That bo that bodes real ill. Well, let's, uh, let's do something like that. Get some AoE damage and see what kind of shit I can do against these fuckers. Oh, that's not bad. It's mostly my ability to tank is what's gonna be the, uh, the test here. I don't think I can win this. I'm just gonna throw that out of there. I don't think I can win this. Especially if they keep cutting in line like that, I don't think this really doesn't bode well for little old me. Just throwing it out there. I mean, maybe? Maybe? If her, like, like fucking Sepith move was AoE, I'd, I'd feel a lot better, but it's not, so. There's gotta be a way I can hit all of them. No? Alright, four will do. I don't know. I really don't know. Like, I'm probably gonna die in this next round, but I could probably full heal and be okay. Oh, now I can't attack. That's a bit of a problem. Will it let me use items, or is it just gonna skip my turn? Nope, okay, yeah, that's it, I'm dead. I'm super dead. I don't think I can win this fight. Yep, nope, couldn't win it. Couldn't win it. That's comforting. Like, <laughs> like that's really comforting that I can't win that fight. Okay. Ah. Hmm. <laughs> All talk and no action. We're ordered not to kill you, but a good beating should suit our needs just fine. Do resist, won't you? That'll make it more fun. Dot dot dot. Just in time. 
Looks like you're having a hard time. Allow me to assist. Not necessary, soldier. We're just about to start a punishment. You're certainly welcome to watch, though. I wasn't talking to you. What are you? It's Joshua. Too slow. What? Uh, what are you doing? I'm sorry. Well, you're not cut out for this. Blorf! Norf! Dot, dot, dot. Really? What are you thinking? Oh, shit. You may be a full bracer, but you're still a total loose cannon. What are you going to gain by trying to fight them all by yourself? No way. <laughs> Joshua? This, uh, this isn't a dream, is it? Things would be nicer if this was a dream. Unfortunately, reality isn't so convenient. Huh? You finally show yourself. It's been a while, Lo. You knew I would find my way on board? It was entirely possible given your skills. Still, I'm curious as to how you actually managed it. I boarded one of the scout ships that went ahead of the Glorious to check its route. None of the enforcers were about, so it was fairly trivial to sneak in. If you even guessed that Viceman would request the Ark. You really haven't lost your touch, Black Fang. All thanks to you, really. Though it was, though it always was a bit nerve-wracking, wondering if you would, you or someone else would find me. <laughs> there are a few who can see through your skill of obstification. But stealth has its weaknesses. The instant you note someone notices you, you lose one advantage. You have lost your advantage, Black Fang. What do you think a Fang can do against the Blade Lord? Dot dot dot. Wait. For your information, Lo. I'm still plenty ready to go. I don't care how strong you are, we won't make it that easy on- Stand back, Castell. Lo is powerful. More so than both of us combined. Ah. And knowing that, you still came here. Some might call that naive, but I know you better than that. What drove you to leave her in the first place? Dot dot dot. Um. If you wish to protect someone, protect them. If you wish to cut them from your life, then do it. Completely. Did I not teach you to be thorough, to be decisive? Yes, you did. That was the first lesson you taught me after Weissman was done tuning me. If she means that much to you, you should never have left her side. You should have stayed with her, tormented by guilt or otherwise. The fact that you didn't is just another form of escapism, nothing but deceit. I know that, Lo. I know what you're trying to tell me. Do you really? Joshua. But in that case, what about you, Lo? This should have been my price all along to pay, my burden. And yet you joined the society too, and now they call you the Blade Lord. Why are you still working with Weissman? Dot dot dot. My cooperate cro God damn it, I can't talk. My cooperation with Weissman is nothing to do with you. I did so because of my desires. Your desires? You mean about Karen? Petty revenge won't bring Karen back. So I wanted to see if her death was worth it. I want to put humanity to the test. That's why I'm working with the professor. Put humanity to the, to the test? Enough talking. You have three options. You and the girl both surrender. You protect the girl and you die, or you abandon the girl and escape by yourself. Make your choice. Joshua! I'm sorry, but I'll be taking option four. What? What? You! I fiddled with the orbital engines a little. Left alone, the society's glorious arc will be another wreck on the ocean floor soon. Hey Joshua, can you maybe warn me when you- You really are a magician. You need authorization for the engine room, so I didn't think you'd be able to worm your way in there. I altered each of the 22 engines in a slightly different manner. Weissman could sort it out. Maybe Rene too, but with them gone, you're, you're the only one left. The only one left is you, Lo. Final ace in the hole to put a stop to the plan. Well done. But to use it now, <laughs> just how long do you intend to keep deluding yourself? I hope you have an answer when we next meet. I'll be looking forward to it. Dot, dot, dot. Joshua? I, uh, we can talk later. I've got an airship prepared for an escape. We need to head down to the stairs ahead of us and get out of the hangar. Uh, yeah, come on. Hot damn! Oh, Estelle's dead. I should probably, uh, I don't think I have any reviving bombs. Shit. Um, does Joshua have... No, he doesn't. He super doesn't. Um, he's got a lot of shit, though. God damn. But he does not have, um, a healing ornament. So, uh, what's his equipment at? 
I know this probably isn't the best time, but I just want to make sure he's wearing the best he can. Um, yeah, nope, he's got... Actually, I could probably give him a little bonusy trinket thing that could... Defends against KO, Earth-based. Uh, yeah, you know what? Fuck it. Here, take a lighter. All right, let's go, Josh. Time to go. Bum, 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 ba -dup, ba -dup, ba -dup, ba -dup. Oh, thank God. Oh, thank God. All right. Now, Estelle will be revived. Okay, let's save the game real quick. Files, save. There we go. Time to go. Um, this way. Yes. Okay. So far, so good. Hit this guy. It's a preemptive attack. Let's see how much damage Josh can do. <laughs> yeah, that seems about right. That's that. Let's move out. Oh, that's how he sounds. It's a lot deeper than uh than what I've been giving him. He's just gonna have to deal with it. This way. Thank you. Star rabbits. Okay, can't cross those things, so we need to just keep worming our way through. Um, yeah. Right? I think this is right. Bridge. Good, good, good. Uh, nope, not that way. This place is a fucking maze. Holy shit. Damn it all! Even with powerful Josh, I'm not liking our chances there, so we're just gonna bail. Kip. Uh, this way. This way. This way. Cross the bridge. This way. I'm probably missing quite a bit of loot, but... I kind of just want to bail, you know? Okay. I just wanted to make sure that wasn't a loot thing. Get that guy. Wipe him out for me, Josh. <sighs> what? Seriously, man? All right, Estelle, get in there. Show him you're no slack in the combat department either. All righty. That's that. Okay. Keep him moving. Okay. Just make it nice and quick. Uh, there's no point where we didn't take any damage. So there's zero point. Okay. Sorry, I was pouring tea. Uh, avoid that. I'm just gonna zoom. Ah, crap. I have no idea where I'm going. Let's try this path. This looks right. Gate is shut tight. Crap. Maybe this thing? Nope. All right. Uh, maybe the right side? Nope, it's shut tight. Okay. Then we have to go this way. Crap. Come on, Josh. There you go. All right, left. Up the stairs. This way. Oh, this place is so big. I need to get to the end of the hallway. Is basically where I need to go. Proxy puppet. Okay. What does that do? Um. Defense against KO. Okay, that's what that is. Not a not a bad thing to have. Crap salad. Done, done. Okay, yep, cross the bridge. Good. Then we need to head right. Check in here. Come on, loot. Maybe I need to go all the way down, like this path. Take him out! God damn. He is a powerful <laughs> some bitch. I mean, he is eight levels higher than me, so. It does make sense, but I'm just like, damn. Josh has not been dicking around, man. He's been doing some work. Impressive work, to say the least. Avoid that guy. I assume these both go to the same location. I'm correct. Excellent. Down again. I could rest, but there's no point. I still haven't taken any damage. I will save, though, because I have a sense of something about to occur. Yep. 
Nice, it's the hangar. Oh, man. There's one ship. Holy. Since when does an airship have its own landing port? Yes. The Crimson Ark, the glorious pride of the society is meant to be a mothership of sorts. It can provide berthing for up to 12 smaller vessels. That's unbelievable. I secured a ship earlier for our escape. It's in the hangar furthest. Got it. 